Wuthrich. Turned over onto the waiting stick of Ryan Dezingle. Ahead for Anthony Greco. Back to Greco in tight to Zingle. They score! Ryan Dezingle and the Buckeyes have drawn first blood. And they've given the Buckeyes the all important first goal in the game. Well, that balance that we talked about in the open two line. He'll move it over to Russo and he will get it by Jardine. The Irish have a three on one. Schneider left wing side holds. He shoots. He scores! Peter Schneider! A twisted wrister! He beats Jelly, glove side, a three-on-one breakout, and the Irish tie the game at one with 9.08 to go in the first period. Here come the Buckeyes right in, Lippincott. It certainly looked like it went in, but wow. they say no. It looked like it may have hit the middle bar. Wow. They'll certainly review this. Nice feed off the iron. Wow. Oh. Here's the overhead. Great fortune for Summer Hayes. An excellent no call by the officials. You can see there it never crossed the line as he swept it with that left leg. One tip that front. James David Gerst, 15 for the power play. Tynan, left point to the left circle. Takes a shot. He scores! TJ Tynan, target practice. He beat Jelly. Short side, stick side, power play goal, Notre Dame, 2-1 Irish, 16-10 to go in the third. TJ Tynan always looked more of a passer first, and I think he just lulled everybody into sleep. He'll dump it off left wing, and that is Fritz. Spins away from Tynan into the corner, leaves the puck behind. Rust will come over and tie it up with Dalrymple with 110 left. Puck comes free, pass to Costello, center ice, only getting to beat. He'll shoot from center ice, he scores! Empty netter Jeff Costello, and the Irish are going to play for the CCHA tournament title tomorrow. Instead, it goes down into the corner, no support. Good work as has been the case the second half of the hockey game. Beautifully done by Notre Dame. But the Buckeyes had the faceoff one, the puck where they wanted to, but opted to go low instead of to the net. In the semifinal, as Notre Dame will skate to a 3-1 victory as they advance to the CCHA championship game tomorrow at 2 to face either Miami or Michigan.